Hello everyone, my name is Larseth, and welcome back to episode 30 of our kill campaign in European Versailles 4. And in this episode, we're going to be doing a... Well, after, that is, we deal with these rebels here. We're hopefully going to be uh, looking a bit more into what alliance change we could build up in um, India. Oh god, how have we gotten big enough that France has put us an ally? Yee. So, one of the main reasons, at least, I think Delhi won't rival won't, um, I was going to say one of the main reasons they won't ally us is because of, uh, Kill was us rivaling Persia, in which case we could just swap out Persia for somebody else. But even with that, it doesn't look like that they would change their mind. Um, hopefully, mo getting the Maldives should, uh, change some of this, um, distance from borders problems we've been having. We're just waiting for the rest of our army to assemble. And then we're... <coughs> excuse me. I'm going to go straight after these rebels that spawned. Oh god, loads of events. Uh, so we've got to replace an advisor. Oh, that was our plus three person as well, so that is not ideal. Um, I'm going to wait for a minute. And see if a plus two comes up. Uh, what else can we do? Oh, that was the other thing. It was the estate stuff that expired, didn't it? So, maybe we can get... Could we get... Yes, Grant New World Charters. Lovely. Right, so that's that. those rebels dealt with. Um, right, the Maldives is now ours. So, let's have a look. Has that made anyone more likely to ally me. Distance between borders doesn't appear to have changed in the slightest. <laughs> Typically. Improve relations with malware. Um, so let's have a look at Vaginagar. See what they're... Uh, ooh, I need to order it, don't I? I swear it used to start off from A to Z, or A to Z if you're American. Um, like, automatically. Now it just seems to go by great power, which is a little odd. Um, and why am I even looking there? Yeah, Vagina Guard. So they got seven, ooh, ugh, 74k troops. Uh, that might be interesting. Uh, what about Jarkand? What have they got now? Jarkand have got 26, potentially up to 41k. Um, what about Mewar? They got 36. Bengal have got how many? Wow, potentially up to 67, so about mid 50s. But then their manpower has absolutely been tanked by their war with Jean Poor. So if we do that, it'll be re a real hard war, I think. Um, right, so let's move. Is this guy repaired? Let's get, make sure he's fully repaired. Should only be one tick. Right. There we go. Our... Guy came of age, and he's very good. We like this. 5-4-3. You know, after the run of terrible guys we've had, this guy's a breath of fresh air. So, that's fine. We're happy to go with him. So, what we're going to do now is take our army. Bring it all the way over here. We'll move these guys over. We still have our core claims. Yes, we do. How long for? 54. Okay, so quite a while. So what we're going to do is go to War Maj Hapit now. Or try to, at least. Hopefully Malika will join us. That would be really useful because we could do with their navies to help us. Speaking of navies, I could probably, or probably should, get 20 more trade ships. Of course, I need a bit more money before I can afford those just yet. But given the fact that we don't have any level 3 advisors at the moment, that shouldn't be too long before we do ha have that much money. Lovely. There we go. We'll build all those. What can I do to Vagina Gar? Have they got any rebels? They do. Are they at war? They're at war with Sindh, Malwa, and Shamar. Hmm. 
Hmm. I'm just trying to think. Do we take advantage of this? Bengal will join. So who is it? It's Sind, Malwa, and Shamar. I'm just worried that Malwa are going to get chewed up in this war. And Vagina Gar are going to pretty much ruin them. Um, like, take a load of their provinces, which will just make in, like, much, much harder for me to do anything about it. Do we? Is that a really stupid thing to do? Um... What about Delhi? Sind? He... I don't know what to do. I'm a bit... I'm, uh, I'm conflicted. Damn it. Um... Encouragingly, at least for John Agar, I haven't got any... ...ideas and that I don't have any offensive ideas, although they are two military techs ahead of me. And they're actually two ahead of Bengal as well, which is really annoying. <sighs> Do we play it safe? I think for the moment we play it safe. I don't see how that could end well for us. But then, I don't know. I don't know! Let's have a look, Vaginagar. If their manpower starts dropping, then I'll go to war with them. Until such a thing happens, I don't think we should. Although... Actually, I think sod it. Let's see what happens. Um... Mobilize the troops. So amazingly, that meant that Bengal's fleet caught Jharkhand's fleet just by pure chance of them being on top of one another. Um, both of my armies are now down here. So I probably want to get them somewhere else. Just make sure all these guys are set as uh, go home at war. I don't want anyone getting killed for no reason. Um, although Bengal didn't really have a lot of troops, did they? A lot of manpower, sorry. They had quite low manpower. Which might come back to bite me, but there we go. So, <clears throat> what do we do? Can we, can we get up to Bengal? They've got a lot of troops there. Is there any way of me getting through? Let's give that a sec. Let's just let it play a second and see what happens. I think we give Bengal... How much Bengal's treasury at? Uh, treasury, treasury, treasury. B, Bengal. Holy hell. 2,535. Okay, never mind. I'm not giving them any money. Damn. Um, I think we still go to war with these guys. We've got our armies here. We've been repeatedly trying to do this. So we should, while we have the chance. Mainly, I wanted to declare this war just to throw off. Um, I'm going to give Sin some money. Send gift. Uh, how much are we going to give him? 300. I mainly wanted to just declare the war to throw off this other war that's going on. If we have to wipe peace out of it, you know, that's not the end of the world. Hopefully, I'd really like to see Delhi try and help out in this war through some manner. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, da, 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 da. No, that one. So I can't actually see much hub it anywhere. Let 
What else do we need to do? Advisor, we're fine without at the moment. Uh, disloyal Estates, right. Amir's wants something. Do you know? Do you know? How much is this? Is that... It's two, base 250 manpower. It's base 500, so I think we give... Isn't Coastal Center of Trade, though. So I probably should give that to... Somebody else. And give that to the Amirs, actually. Hopefully this war shouldn't... What are you doing? Were these guys... Why... Oh, my transports. I forgot, forgot to put them back. Herdider. So I need to build, what, three more transports? Uh... One, two, three. There we go. Do I try and get a, another... Let's try for another ruler. Okay, no, they're not another ruler. Sorry, another general. Just as bad. I'm not going to split these up. I'm going to methodically go along the line. Um, that's the beauty of this March Hobbit's land, Elite for Conquer, is it is just one strip. It's no... Uh, it's... Fairly easy. A reformer has been... Oh, why does that matter to me? Home. How's this going? Not so well. Uh, although Sindh of the, uh, appear to have got a load of mercenaries. I need to help out there relatively soon, methinks. Right, that province is just finished. Is that province done as well? No, not quite. So I'm going to get these guys to come all the way around there. So they can hop across somewhere else. Right, that battle was ended. Hmm... Luckily, Bengal is still winning in the seas quite easily. Has this war done anything? Come on, I really want Delhi to declare war on Mewar. That would just be the dream. Have they got a truce with them? No, they don't. So I really want Delhi to declare war on Mewar. That would just... Oh, it would complete me. I'm going to try and get enough to support rebels in Vaginagar. Uh, maintain our guy in Malwa. I'll also maintain... Might as well... Oh, cancel. Cancel again. Royal marriage in Bengal. And should improve our relations. There we go. Yep, we won down there as expected. That's pretty good. How's our manpower? Manpower is absolutely fine at the moment. I'd say we're probably still gaining it faster than we're losing it. Ooh, that was a bit of a shock. Um, that's fine. Did I just stack wipe them? No, I didn't. I do have to be careful, though. Uh, maintain our guy in Bengal. Our guy in Vagina Gargar, of course, straight away. I can almost get another military tech. Which is really good. Um, I'm gonna try, call our guy from Malwa back and try and make peace. Have they just fleshed that army out with mercenaries? Oh my god, I just got both of my armies stack wiped. Nice. Um, Because I wanted those, didn't I? 
So, both of my armies just got stack wiped. Quite how that works, I'm not sure. So now we're in what looks like two wars we're going to lose. And I managed to get through all that without swearing, which is quite amazing, really. Uh, 15, 16, so we want maybe 6 cavalry and at least 12 per army. So we'll go for that. Uh, I don't care what name it is. So we need... God damn it. So we need to wait a while, essentially. So our peace is going to vanish. Peace offer from Jarkand. Um, what do they want? Jarkhand will annul all treaties with, treaties with Jainagar. That's pretty good, actually. So I'm going to accept their... That's pretty good, actually. I'm happy with that. So now they've broken their alliance with uh, Vijayanagar. I'm not sure why Malwa haven't sieged down. Or maybe they're trying. They are trying, bless them. Come on, Delhi, you can freaking do this. You pains in the asses. Um, I need to save all my money for my armies. I can't believe that. I, can't, I just genuinely cannot believe that. Um, right, so... Okay, so it looks like we're probably going to lose these territories until such time that we can take them back. That's actually not so... That won't be so hard. I'm just amazed that we got stack wiped. Like, I can understand losing, but I can't understand why we got stack wiped. Who else is kicking up a fuss? I don't like unrest. Get, go away. Don't like you. Wow, the Ottomans have mobilized. Who are the Ottomans? Shamar and Persia. Okay, so it might be the Persia are about to feel the feel the heat. Unfortunately, it looks like Bengal are also feeling it a little bit. Their treasury is depleted by about a thousand, but they still have plenty of money. I'll improve relations with Malika, just because they've dropped off a little bit. So I should be able to now get some troops coming. Let's make our army. Great. Wow, so our recruitment was sabotaged. So that was actually pretty smart by the uh, by the AI. Whether or not they realized we were building stuff and then did it, maybe. I don't know. Um, that guy. So we need to find... Okay, so they've taken all of those stuff. I think we need to go and help out in this war against Vaginagar. Have they peaced out? They have. So that means it's just Vaginagar and Mewar against Bengal. Okay, this ought to be interesting. And Delhi are still just sat on their, sat on their hands. Which is a little bit annoying. Um, and to top it off, my navy's just got wrecked. <sighs> it's times like this you just want to you just want to cry. Well, you want to stop playing the game and then and then you want to cry. Um, so what I do need is some transports. I probably want forty transports. That'll cost me 700 to build. Lovely. So, I guess... This was a bit of a stupid thing to do. <laughs> As if that wasn't plainly obvious. I genuinely thought it'd be so much easier to beat Magic Hoppet than it actually turned out to be. Uh, 
Bengal annulled all treaties with me. Okay, there we go. Will they accept a concession of defeat? They won't. Okay, so it looks like we're going to war with uh, them on our own. Hooray! <laughs> oh well, maybe we don't bother with our 40 transport ships then. It looks like we're just building another army. Um, lose money and gain base tax. That seems fine. So, where are they most likely to land? The, uh... Ooh, lovely. And, uh, sorry, I mean, where a vagina guard most likely to land their troops? Who knows, because they probably will come after us. I mean, they've got six... They've got enough transports to move a navy. Oh, for... F God's sake! So, much Hoppet are going to uh, cause us some issues, so I'm just going to refuse any peace, I imagine, with these guys, because I think I can come and beat them without too much issue, without too much trouble. Uh, but I will do that next episode. So thank you very much for watching, and I will speak to you then. Take care.